Hey guys, Perry here. I'm outside. I come out of the office every once in a while and it's finally super nice again in LA. So I decided to hit the streets this time and I want to know what people around town know in terms of celebrities. Can they recognize celebrities and some very familiar faces that you guys might know? Let's find out. All right, so we're gonna play a game. We have some celebrity photos here, and the game is you gotta guess who it is. You think you're gonna do pretty well? Names? I think so. Yeah. I think so. She probably know better than I do. Okay. I think she knows better than I do. So, so who, who's gonna win here? Do you actually have a chance? I have a chance, yeah. But tell me a little bit about your celebrity guessing skills. Do you think you're gonna get very many of these? No, not really. I'm gonna start really easy. That's supposed to be easy? Oh my gosh, wait, the, he does look familiar. Oh, that's Dan Cook. That's not Dan Cook. No, not Dan Cook. Uh, <laughs> that's Ryan Gosling. Ryan Reynolds. Oh, yeah, Ryan Reynolds. There we go. He's awesome. Man, like, like, I know. Hugh Jackman. All right. All right. You're one, one for one. Hugh Jackman. There you go. You've seen Logan? I've, I have not seen Logan oh. yet, but I've seen his other ones. Well, that was the wrong answer. You should go <laughs> see that movie after we play this game. Ah, uh, uh, I don't know his name. Do you know this I one? couldn't say even if nope, I Nope, I pass. Yeah. Oh, that's... Uh, He's a director, Peter or something. I don't know, I'm kind of looking at his Sasquatch shirt going on, so I feel like it's King Kong. That shirt kind of throws you off a little. <laughs> like Planet of the Apes, I don't know. Talking like Lord of the Rings? Lord of the Rings, there you go. All right, all right, I'll give you that. I'll give you that. Different. Their hair is all jacked up, no makeup, you know, they look different. Ah, yes, uh, Mr. Christopher Pratt. Oh, yeah. Oh, Chris Pratt. Chris, that's not a face you forget. His face is more important than his name. Really? Gorgeous, look at it. I know that's true. <laughs> Guardians of the Galaxy, come we on. Dudes, come on. I'm, I'm not the biggest fan of Guardians. How many times have you seen Guardians? Uh, twice, I believe. I need to see it again. I think so. Uh, oh my god, singer, this right? girl. How old am I? T take a guess. Like, look at her and her picture. Like, what would you think she'd be in? Mm, donuts, okay. She's into sweets. Um, a movie with a donut? I don't know. Racially ambiguous. Jeez, where's our Debbie Reynolds and fuck <laughs> those good guys? Fuck, those are where I'm at. She looks like she can sing. She can sing, can't she? She can sing. I knew it. She looks like she has a good voice. Oh, that's uh. Yeah, that's my girl. That's uh. Let's see if I can remember her name. I watch her on How to Get Away with Murder. Right. <laughs> the girl might have just won an Oscar. Yeah, I, I know. I know who she is. I'm just trying. <laughs> the name is just. Oh wow, you got me in a crazy time. Viola Davis. Yes. Oh my oh. I'm happy you got that. How to get away with He's murder like is my life. How to get away with murder. He usually looks like he'd be in like sports or something, like yeah, an announcer. Yeah, he's like a sports person. Like a wrestling announcer, am I right? Maybe. Maybe. I don't watch enough movies for this. You look at that face. What does that face say to you? He looks like a coach or something. That's not the same guy that was in uh, like scary movies or any of those, is it? He's the king of the schmodown. Do you know what the schmodown is? No. What's the it sounds like a mixture of Motown and country line dancing. <laughs> the exact opposite of that. He looks like maybe mistaken, like people don't get him. He's in high school. He's very angsty. I can tell by the eyes. Actually, know. you know what? I feel like I know his face. But this picture is distracting right now. <laughs> I can't. He looks like the guy who plays Shaggy, but it's not him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like Shaggy and Scooby-Doo? Yeah. Like Matthew Lillard? Yes. Yeah, like yes. That guy. I feel like I should know her because she's Asian, but that's really racist of me to say. Hmm. Some Disney film, I guess. It's Disney pretty appropriate. Show or something. I'm Asian, so it's fine. I guess. <laughs> that's the rule. Do you know who this is? I do not know who this is. Is that? Did he get? No. Did he gain weight? <laughs> the comedian? <laughs> I think he was the trainer. He was the, he was definitely the, the trainer of uh, Matt Damon in the latest Bourne film. Jamie Kennedy with weight? He looks like <laughs> Jamie Kennedy with a few pounds on. This is John Campia. My oh. dad would probably know who that is, not me. <laughs> oh, gosh, I'm the racist one. Okay. Um. <laughs> if you were to cast him in a movie, what would you pick? Enter the Dragon, I guess, a martial arts action film or something. So he can kick some ass? Yeah, it looks like he can kick some butt. Is this the new Spider-Man? There's no way. This doesn't look like the new Spider-Man. Is that the guy? Is that the new uh, Spider-Man? No. no. That's too, no, he's not. It's too old. Yeah, he is. 
Okay, new Spider-Man. I'm locking in the answer. I think that's a new Spider-Man. You get all the points for that one. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I don't know who that is. Uh, Do you think you've seen him anywhere? No, no, I don't even recognize him from anything. Hey, Mr. Jeremy Johns. Very good. Oh, you. Does this thing with his mouth. <laughs> Say awesome tacular. <laughs> What's that? Awesome tacular. <laughs> oh, damn it. Why did I automatically think Dr. I Miami caught the is... dog. It's not Dr. Miami. <laughs> oh, his dog is so cute. <laughs> Where does that face belong? Everywhere. Pick okay. a movie for him. A comedy with Seth Rogen. Like twins. Okay, I'll take that. Yeah. <laughs> Hangover. Hangover? <laughs> Yeah. What would he be in The Hangover? Like one of those people who sold them drugs and like effed up their night. <laughs> you just won the game. That was amazing. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. Thanks for really sticking up, Perry. I think he was spot on. You'd be a great person in The Hangover. Oh, I thought you were going to say a great drug dealer. <laughs> well, I'm, I know nothing about that. I will take Hangover any day of the week. I feel like I'm like the, uh, a decent mix of Galifianakis, Ed Helms, the guy that they find on the roof and Bradley Cooper, but mostly Bradley Cooper, let's be honest. I was about to say you're giving yourself a lot of credit, but not really. Perry, do I ever give myself a lot of credit? Like the fact that I created the bloopers. That's right, your next uh, next segment. Perry thinks she created it, but she didn't. It was all my mind, child. Frank films it, I make it happen. Perry just puts it out there. Am I right, Perry? What's going on? It's time for me to host the show. It's Collider Movie Talk. You're right over there. I'm gonna fall asleep. My, my daughter, my daughter, woke up last night. I was over there all night. Sorry, guys. I'm doing the best I can. <laughs> there you go, kid. Watch that Tron thing. You and your me and your ma are gonna go up. You know, I thought we all experienced that. Is your I'm dad not... one of the jerky boys? <laughs> <laughs> I'm your host, Sinead DeFreeze. This is the show we break down everything in the world of TV and talk about the week that was. No one wants to play our game. I don't wear glasses, but I'm a bell. I'm a little <laughs> mouthful. What do you guys think? How's this look? Oh, I can't even find my camera. It's these new glasses today. <laughs> these new glasses today are very sharp. Let me get my camera. I feel like everything's back. moving around me. There's no Indiana Jones 5 news, according to Mark Riley. And Perry Nemiroff <laughs> shows me which camera to look at. Excuse me. Hi. No, no. Up. Oh. We were doing so well for a while. I get bored standing at the urinal going to the bathroom without my cell phone in my hand. Next topic. <laughs> it's the first time I ever saw, saw Paranormal. I said it again. I saw it. I saw it I saw up it. in uh, Dorchester. Yeah, yeah. 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 I was I soaring up in the sky. You know what I was soaring? Something. <laughs> What's RPG mean? Rocket propelled grenade? Role playing game. Role playing game. Role-playing game. Cody, who is currently throwing a tantrum yelling at people. Check. Adam. Check. Dennis. Check. 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 Check? Yeah. Check, it's, check. it's good, right? Oh my god, there's hey! Tony. Tony. Check. Tony. Check. Just like, why are you following me? Here, you want to do my plugs for me? Sure, you can find him at uh, Mark Gellis Live. Yeah, yeah that uh, works. he's doing some stand-up stuff. <laughs> uh, he's on Schmoes No, Wednesday nights, and uh, yeah, other stuff. Check, check. I don't know why you just sounded so, like, radio announcer. Like, we're bringing in, we're bringing havoc, we're leading up to Jedi, we're at the Star Wars show, right. it's awesome, and yeah. It was well rumored that the guy had a huge member. He was working that thing around in the uh, the royals of the... Uh, <laughs> oh, spoiler alert! Next <laughs> week. <laughs> and right next to me with traffic and sports, it's Ken Naps, uh, oh, Kylo wow. Ken. Hey, glad to be here, guys. We got some big hits coming up. You call in that line, 100-549 Jedi. It started a terrible trend. I played saxophone too. Does that give me any credit in this situation? I love you. <laughs> I was going to make what? out with Josh, but now. I'm sorry if uh, my voice is a little off. I'm a little bit of a cold, I think. So. Have you been, have you been oh. making out with John Campion? He's a handsome man. It's <laughs> difficult to resist those eyes, you know. It's tough. Broken Oats, I'm talking about. And right now with his brand new Star Wars news, it's Griff FN2187. David Griffin is here. He's a man. Oh my God. And you see Chris, that's a man. <laughs> Jeffy Jacobs says, you know, it's stupid for the guy who likes Star Wars to say Goldblum looks crazy. First of all, didn't say he looked crazy. I said he looked stupid. Next question. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, aren't you going to answer the one that I just asked? Oh, yeah, I forgot it already. Biggest, Something about red letters. <laughs> Still don't get it. That's Kenny G. Right? Yeah. Uh, do we do we have to edit that out? Do you have the rights to that? 
He just seems like a cool dude. And with the short hair, he looks great. He looks fantastic. And so this, I'm excited Are for this. Are you hitting on Chris Hemsworth? I, I would absolutely. Hey, the shorter the better, man. That's I what I'm talking about. I would go to a movie with Chris Hemsworth absolutely, and buy him dinner. <laughs> but, and how off the his butt hurts. So you know what? Shut up. I don't know what those whip and black leather kind of terrify me. You know, I'm a little guy. I don't know what's going on there, but she was hot. And you know, DeVito was fantastic. So I'm getting a little too deep. <laughs> you, you, you too had much some information. conflicted feelings. Too much information. Yeah. Conflicted feelings. Um, what's going but, on in my pants? No, sorry, but uh, he, he wanted one w wish about uh, to describe what what uh, The Last Jedi meant. Uh, Johnson's saying everyone knows that last and final are cinnamons, right? Uh, they, they mean exactly the same. they cinnamons? Cin cin God, what's wrong with you, <laughs> you people? Sorry. What's wrong with all you people? Collider.com and be sure to <laughs> It means the final, it means, it means, it means yeah, the final right Jedi. Oh, right. Right. Oh, wow. <laughs> and let's all have some cinnamon <laughs> toast crunch right now. <laughs> It's a bye 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 for him. Uh, it's Backstreet Boys is stupid. Um, so then they, they, it's actually interesting. It's good. I'm glad I didn't know it. Wait, I absolutely buy this too. I think Danny DeVito is going to bring that kind, right kind of grab. Grab it. Uh, I don't want to say it because people are going <laughs> to grab it. Grab it. Take some shots. Shot. You know Everyone what? home takes some <laughs> shots. Grab it. Shot. I mean, Omar was a different type of character in The Wire for sure. <laughs> Excuse me, what was that? Um, <laughs> put that in the bloopers. Um, what the hell was that? We should have a gravitas a, jar it's a on good Friday word. shows. Just, every time you say it, you got to put a dollar in the gravitas. And then we can buy, we can buy pizza right? with the money. Well, you like Star Wars, so if you like stupid things, go to sleep. That's what you do. Take a little nap, have someone rub your head and go, oh, you're feeling better, you're feeling better, grab some tea, and then go go back to bed. So you should factor in the editor, too. Yeah, maybe, that's what I just maybe said, yeah. some. Oh, sorry. Yeah, the I editor, was listening to you. I know, I know. My bad. It's now I feel it's better. Sorry. All three of you have seen this episode. Uh, yes. Yeah. Mm. Okay, moving on. She, you haven't, she she didn't didn't see it. Oh, no, not she, again. No. Yeah. Every oh, week. No, yeah. not again. Yeah. No, you calm down, Chris Height. Um, I, I calm down. No idea what I deal with in the morning. And as a little side note, I actually had her in my room uh, last week uh, at Universal Studios. It's, it's, I thought uh, that was going to be a really awkward story. Yeah, yeah. But then you should have led with the yeah, Universal so Studios I. first. You're like, oh, I and had her in my room, in last your room. Week. I'm like, sorry. <laughs> Bad boys for life. The report cites two reasons. <laughs> <laughs> Riley, get him out of here! <laughs> oh my gosh! Get him out of here. <laughs> guys, that was so fun! Pretty sure my armpits are sweating. All right, guys, that's it. That's all the time we have for you this weekend. But before I sign off, I'm giving you something you want. It's Grace. Hey, Grace. <laughs> hey, guys. Tell everyone where they can find you on the internet. You can find me on Twitter and Instagram at, at Mrs. Grace. So after you go do that and look at all of her wonderful pictures on Instagram of our office mascot, Rat, check out some of these other episodes of Collider Behind the Scenes. They're great. And next time, we'll have even more for you. Later, guys.